Introducing the brand new 25th anniversary Unity Double Deck Box. Holographic design inside and out. And made with premium leather. Each deck box includes three leather dividers, one metal field center, and one TSX-1 attribute dice. Save the drop date now. April 12th, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard at TSX1.com. Ladies and gents, it is time. Yes, I know. We make videos on fire. Yes, fire decks, snake eyes, volcanics. Fire, 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 fire. But let me tell you guys right now, in Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel, there is a brand new deck that's so underlooked that you probably didn't even know existed. In today's Master Duel video, we're going to be extinguishing fire. Not with fire, but with water. It's water in my hands. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Because you guys are diehard core fans of Reginald Casso, aka Shark, and his evil version, aka Nash. Shark got brand new support. We're going anime level in today's episode. We're going to be unlocking the true powers of the deep. Let's begin. Yo! Ladies and gents, in the brand new selection pack, Blazing Arena, we get literally bombarded with fire cards. We have Volcanics. Yes, Emperor's here. Bonfire. Infernal Flame Banshee. We got, of course, Battling Boxers. But what the heck is this? Nobody's talking about this card, guys. Food Armor Dark Knight Lancer. This card is actually insane. And you guys can correct me if I'm, I'm wrong, but this is one of Shark's craziest cards. Like, the, the Lancer cards are his cards right here. And what this card does is that once per turn, you can also XC summon Full Armor Dark Knight Lancer. By using one rank 5 or rank 6 Xyz monster control, it gains 3 attack for each material and equipment it has. Once per turn, you can target one Xyz card in your graveyard. Add it to your hand. Once per turn, if an equipped card becomes equipped to a monster, except during the damage step, you can attach one monster your opponent controls to this card as material. So this card right here, whenever it gets equipped with something, it steals an opponent, it sucks an opponent's monster. Like a shark. It just, it just, it just snatches a monster. In today's massive new video, we're going to go full anime level with Fold Armor Dark Knight Lancer. Before we get into today's video, this video is powered by Supreme Pro. Be sure to visit TX1.com to get your Supreme Pro sleeves today. Links will be in the description box below. There is a bundle where you guys can save over $50 in savings where you guys can get a playmat and 10 packs of sleeves. And by using the code POC10 and POTATO10, you guys can save big on these bundles. Also, free shipping on orders over 100 USD to USA. So guys, take advantage of that. Ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow, April the 12th at 8 p.m. EST at TX1.com. The brand new 25th anniversary Unity Deck Box is dropping live. TX1.com. Get yours today because at 8 p.m. EST, this bad boy is dropping. One of the most beautiful deck box I've ever released here on TX1. You guys have been asking, Sam, when are you releasing deck boxes? Well, yo, this is the very first drop since winter. Only limited amount of these are going to be available. Once they're gone, they're gone forever. So make sure you guys are there at TX1.com at 8 p.m. EST. Save the date for one of the greatest deck box drop of all time. Baby shark. Do, 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 do. Ladies and gents, here is my shark deck right here. This deck is absolutely insane. Well, the whole goal, because totally awesome, does not exist. Usually we would go, you know, Bahama Shark first. You know what I'm saying? Detach two materials. You know what I'm saying? Something totally awesome. And then Kamala off into our full armor fortress. Guys, correct me if I'm wrong. The full armor cards, are these sharks cards or no? Like, are these sharks cards? Because I know, like, Dark Rain Lance, Dark Knight Lancer is Sharks cards and like the Lancer cards and stuff like that. But are the armor cards Shark cards or not? Let me know because the entire deck is just Sharks. Baby Shark, Xyz Ramora. Why is this card not a Shark? It's a Hammerhead Shark, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, why is it not called Xyz Shark Ramora or some shit? You know what I'm saying? Anyways, yeah. Are are the new armored XC cards Shark cards? Let me know in the comments below, but these cards are absolutely insane. They're basically like one card starters. Like you get access to, of course, any rank four XCs and you have somehow the full XCs armor package. So basically what you're trying to do is like just get access to Dugaris and then you link clan from Dugaris into, of course, full armor fortress. And then you go fortress into, 
of course the the full armored crystallized zero lancer and on top of that you go into full armored dark knight lancer this card retrieves back an xc's card directly from the grave to the hand so it can recycle back xc's remora which is absolutely insane to full to fully extend your plays this card is actually insane the fact that you're able to detach two materials the special in this card if it's summoned this way you basically revive back two level four fishes from the grave which is not once per turn so it sees Amora is one of those cards that you can easily combo off and push through hand traps which is absolutely ridiculous boss all shark's really good it's a one card combo in the deck to be able to get the access into dugaris it's like essentially a tour guide for the deck which is really good abyss shark helps you extend it and also searches your exes amora white mirror can special back and sees amora from the grave and then search another copy of amora directly from the deck to the hand and all these all these cards here are just great one card starters like lifeless leaf fish sends of course crystal shark and then you can combo off that way into your dugaris which is absolutely insane and you can also, on one two-card combos, you can get on boards with, like, multiple four or five disruptions, including having Utopic Draco feature on the field. So the whole premise of this deck is get access to Full Armor Fortress. Full Armor Fortress will search Full Armor at Xyz, and then on your opponent's turn, you can use your monsters to Xyz summon, and then while having Dark Knight Lannister on the field, you can banish the full armor xyz to equip maybe a crystal zero to full armor dark knight lancer and then use dark knight lancer whenever he's equipped with a card to steal and attach one of your opponent's monsters to this card uh you know to this card as a material which is absolutely insane this effect doesn't target by the way which is what makes this card absolutely ridiculous so ladies and gents the whole deck just focuses on summoning xyz monsters and uh, once you summon full armor dark knight lancer you basically just win the duel and cobbling off the boards with cards like Kraken. And, you know, if you open up, if you combine yourself with goals and match and stuff like that, you automatically just win the duel from there on end. So this is pretty much it. This is the most purest shark deck you guys will ever see here in Master Duel. Without further ado, let's start with some of the combos you guys must know when it comes to playing this deck right here. All right, ladies and gents, welcome to some of the most devastating shark combos you guys will ever see here on Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. For this first combo, I'll showcase you guys on what Buzz Shaw Shark can do with opening up XC's Remora. The whole entire goal with this deck is get access to Dugaris, and then you win the duel, and then you freestyle from there on end. It just all depends on what you draw off Dugaris, if you draw another fish, etc., etc. But the combos are just very linear and very standard for you guys to easily pick up and actually understand. For those of you who are actually trying to pick up this deck for the very first time. I just want to give a huge shout out to Deep Sea Daru. Uh, he plays Sharks on YouTube and I watch and learn all the combos from his videos. If you guys want to go ahead and check it out, I'll leave his channel on screen for you guys to check out. So Daru, you're watching this video. This, this, this combo is pretty insane. All right, guys, without further ado, what can Buzzsaw Shark and Xyz Aurora do? So you can normal summon Buzzsaw Shark, activate Shark's effect. You're going to target itself and you're going to special summon another Xyz Aurora directly from the deck. And now what you do next is very simple. You're going to make Dugaris. Here we go. Detach. Remember, guys, okay, if you discarded, like, uh, you know, off Dugaris, draw two, discard one. If you drew, obviously, like, another fish, you're pretty much lit to go, uh, which is insane. So we're going to draw two. So in this case, like, if you draw a leaf fish, you're pretty much Gucci. You know what I'm saying? But for this instance, I'm just going to not... I'm going to pretend like we didn't draw anything. And we're just going to strictly focus on the two-card combo which is going to be Exceso Mora and also Dugaris. And I'm just going to pretend that we drew bricks, you know, uh, uh, with Dugaris or, or additional hand traps or spells, right? Now we make, of course, this right here. Exceso Armor Fortress. This card's insane. You can attach up to two material this card at Armor Exceso card with different names from your deck to your hand. And I can attribute, I can actually summon using one rank three or rank four Exceso Monster Control. So I can use, of course, Armor, Arch, uh, Armor Fortress at detach this to add full armor xyz directly from my deck to my hand which is absolutely insane and now what you do next is that you're going to overlay into crystal zero right here which is ridiculous and then here you're going to overlay into full armor dark knight here full armor dark knight lancer and this is when it gets insane because i can det detach two material from this card to basically here watch i can i can attach two material from this card special summon it i would attach two which is going to be one and two. Okay. We'll summon this guy. And they'll use the effect to summon back two fishes from the grave. So you can summon two fishes. Right here. Summon two fish. One. Two. Now, it's just crazy. Uh, we're not going to use leaf fish. We're just summoning two fish. So this fish is supposed to be Xyz Amora, okay? This is supposed to be Xyz Amora. Okay, this is supposed to be Xyz Amora. We're not going to use life leaf fish, okay? Pretend that's Xyz Amora, okay? 
So it's the same thing. Okay, summon Bahama Shark. Gets insane here. Because we act we get to use Bahama Shark's effect. Then attach this. Summon Torpedo. Right here. And then we'll overlay on top of Torpedo for a uh, black black ray lancer here. Okay. And now it gets insane. Now we can use this right here. To add back a Caesar Mora right here to our hand. Which is ridiculous. Overlay these two for Utopic Future. Okay. Absolutely insane. And then we can overlay these two for Utopic Draco Future. Absolutely insane. And then we can go this. Detach material from, from this guy. From Bahamas Shark. Attach. Summon Remora. We're not going to use Remora because... We're going to pretend like we didn't discard the leaf fish, right? So we're not going to use Momora uh, right here. So I'm not going to use it. So this is your end board right here. This is going to be your end board, uh, which is off two cards and four armored XCs. And this is this is it. This is actually pretty insane. And I'll show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. Because on your opponent's turn, right here on your opponent's turn right here. Watch, I'll showcase you guys this. Right, we can activate four armor XCs right here to either make Dweller for any graveyard based decks or Stealth Kragen uh, using these two cards we control. So for this instance, I'm just use Dweller because let's say we're playing against Snake Eyes. Make Dweller right here. And Dweller will be all, uh, you know, have a water material attached to it. So like they can't just run it over, right? So now what you can do is that Dweller is an interruption, Draco Future is an interruption, and four armor XCs are also an interruption as well because you detach, you target this guy, okay? And then you equip any of these. So you're going to equip the full armor crystallized lancer to it and then this will trigger off of course dark knight lancer to basically steal a monster so you're going to steal this boom right and you have dweller and also drago feeder and also drago feature plus hopefully three non-engine uh, in your hand right and this is like a two card combo xyz remora with buzzsaw shark and obviously the whole entire goal of this deck is trying to get access to Dugaris first. And once you get access to Dugaris, you go into your uh, XC's Armor Fortress and then your full Dark Lancer. And then you go off from there, depending on the cards you have in your hand. But ideally, you have a bunch of fish extenders in your hand, like a Bish Shark and a bunch of other sharks. And you basically go off. And the more sharks you have and the more extenders you have, the more XC's that you're able to put up in the field. But it's just as simple as putting this many XC's on the board with just Bus All Shark and Remora, right? Well, if we did use the Leaf Fish and use, uh, uh, you know, that specific line with Remora, we can end on, uh, we can end on with an additional Stealth Kragen uh, on the field, right? So, the more extenders you have, basically, the more fishes that you have on the field. But this right here is the whole premise of this combo. Uh, get access to one XCs, which is Dugaris, and you basically can have a full board like this. So, right here is just a very standard combo. Let's go on with a quick test hand on what we can do with this deck. Let's go with a test hand. All right, ladies and gents, let's go on with a test hand real quick. So what happens if you open up with a hand like this, all right? So, you know, you know, you have Remora and let's say Tenyi, and you have like White Mirror here. You know, let's let's see what you can do with this. You can normal summon this, and use these two to make Dugaris, right? And now it just depends on what you draw next. Now you want to use Dugaris effect. Attach two. And draw two cards. See? And then we're going to discard one. So we drew into, we drew an Xyz Remora, which is actually pretty good. But it's high. It's not like the best, you know. Let me just set this way because we can just add it back. Uh, and now we can just go into, of course, this. See? Like, the whole goal is trying to climb into this. And we can activate its effect. Attach this. Okay, to add this. And then go this. Okay. And then go this. Okay. And now we just need two fishes in the grave. You know, like, we just need two fishes. We just need as many fishes in the grave as possible. Yeah, this is fine. So we go White Mirror here. Target Remora here. We add a third Remora here. If he had other fishes' names, it would have been way better. Special Summon Remora here. Banish Detach 2. This, is, this will still end on the full board. Summon this. Guys, yeah, because Remora's are our name, right? Which is crazy. So you make Bahama Shark here. You guys see where this is going, right? Like here, detach this. Summon this torpedo. And then you can overlay this for Ray. 
right? You can continue even more because you have a bunch of Remoras here. You can just attach one Remora here. You can attach the other uh, here. Now you have two Remoras. Now you have two fishes in the grave. So now this is going to bring back the two, the two fishes, right? Boom. Boom. And then you can overlay these two for Draco, right? Draco feature here. Yeah. Then you can activate Draco here, overlay on top of this, which is pretty good, right? And you end on like kind of like the similar board as we had last time here. And then we can just even go like Dweller here, right? This gives us four XCs, right? Attach one. Let me use this to add this to hand. And then we special summon this by detaching one and two. Summon this, all right? And then we just hold this, I guess. And this is our turn, right? And this is just using the three cards that we had. So we just end our turn here. And on our opponent's turn, we just wait to see how, and we just go Dweller. Get any graveyard effects our opponent might have. You know what I'm saying? Now we can go with this. I guess make stealth. See? So this just gives us four XCs right here with, with, with that current situation that we're, we, we were given. Just still pretty good. You see this? Like, they, they still can't beat this. And then we go this. We patch this. And this is still like four or five negates, right? This is five negates. It's just crazy. Uh, we can just attach... Of course, Lancer here, it's the biggest. We use the effect, we steal a monster here. You know, just boosting the damage even more, which is really good. We obviously can't draw. I can target XC's card. This in this instance, we can start target this. Which is crazy. And then we can just go off from here, right? Activate this, pop this. We're also protected from monster effects. Battle phase and just attack for game, right? So it just depends on what what the, you know, every hand is freestyle, but the entire goal is to get access through guards. Dugaris and then freestyle from there. So yeah, guys, this shark deck is absolutely devastating. It's really fun to play because one XCs does everything. So yeah, guys, without further ado, let's take all our opponents into deep ocean and send them to the shadow realm with the sharks. Baby shark, do 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 baby shark, do 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 do. All right, guys, ten the gates right now with sharks. Here we go, Maxi or what? What's what's going on? Okay, normal summon buzzsaw shark. Activate Buzzsaw Shark. You special summon a monster from the deck. Target, of course, this. I summon, of course, XC's Remora because this card is absolutely amazing. Remora is insane. So, guys, basically, any way to get to Dugaris is basically a full combo. Like I showcase you guys in the combo in the video. We're going to Dugaris. Draw two cards. You know what I'm saying? Draw two cards. Discard one. Activate this. Uh, draw two. Discard one. You know what I'm saying? So, draw two. Discard one. See if your opponent has anything. Ooh, baby shark. Du, 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 du. I'm, I'm just a right hand shark because if you guys don't know what those cards does that any cards that equips to this cannot be destroyed by battle. So this card is just absolutely insane. Let me read Utopic Feature here. Give me a second. Okay, so I want to discard, of course, right hand shark. All right, and now we and now we just have fun with it. You know what I'm saying? We go with Torpedo. Torpedo is insane. What this card does is that when it's summoned, you can basically detach a material right here to search your form or XC card. Directly from the next to the hand. I'm feeling like we're just supposed to get nib here. If, if we get nib, it's kind of unfortunate, but it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Attach one. Okay. Get four armor axes. Uh, Veiler. It's okay. okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We still can do a bunch of things, guys. We can, use, we can go crystal. All right, crystal guy. Crystal Zero Lancer. All right, we know this. Former Dark Lancer. So honestly, I don't even understand why this card doesn't have an animation. Like, like Konami's slacking on the animations, bro. I'm actually getting very upset. I'm gonna add this to add back in Caesar Mora, which is absolutely ridiculous. So, once I turn, I can target this and add back. You know what I'm saying? It's Caesar Mora back, which is even more insane. What? All right, I guess, like, okay, I guess, so. Okay, just, okay, okay, guys, we're just eating all the hand traps. We're just eating the hand traps, okay. We're eating, we're, we're, we're eating the hand traps, we're eating the hand traps. We can send Leaf Fish. Yeah, send this, 
and then we can just do this, right? We we, we already ate two hand traps. And uh, once per turn, you can talk one XC on your hand. And one XC is hard. Once per turn, even equip comes equipped to a monster you control. Attach one to your, you can attach an opponent's monster. Summon this crystal shark. I think we just make here. Oh yeah, honestly, imagine we could have made Bahamut. That would have been insane. Stell Kragen. I really wanted to make Bahamut shark, but you know, like we have this. It's okay. It's not the greatest. It's not good. But obviously, the monster on the field becomes water. You know what I'm saying? So you know, if they're trying to do some sort of gimmicky plays with different type of attributes, stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Um, they, 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 they might not be able to because their, their stuff is water, right? This is still two interruptions. Snake Eye Ash. Uh, let me just go activate this. I'll just pop the Ash right away. So he gets Populous and then we just save that for the... Like, we just save Ash for the um, uh, for the original. <laughs> okay. We just save Ash for the original and then we should be Gooch. Summon this, get original. If he gets original, we just ash it. If he gets call, called by, he's, he's, he's insane. Like, what else do you want me to do, right? If he gets called by, like, he's just insane. Right? It's it's, it's a water. So you can't make Hida. You can't make Hida, you know what I'm saying? You can't make Hida. You know what I'm saying? Well, Divine Temple. That means he already has that original in his hand. Uh, now, now, now. Okay, Divine Temple's cool. I'm, I'm good with that. It don't even matter at this point, guys. We're just gonna, we're just gonna steamroll this guy. So Flamber, yeah. He, wow, what a what a noob. He's supposed to at least make Link Karibo first. If he has Witch in his hand, then he's just nice. Like, what else am I supposed to do, right? If he has Witch in his hand, he's just nice. Ah! You're so good! I knew it, bro. Man, my goodness. Honestly, what if we still win? We want you su summons Ash. Wait, what is going on? All right, summons Ash from the deck. I guess. Okay. Wait, what? What's what's going on? Okay. Come back, Oak. Oak is in his hand. Wait, what is going on now? Wait, okay. People are really bad at Yu-Gi-Oh, ladies and gentlemen. What you guys know right now? Now he, yo, now he can't trigger off Flamberg. Now he can't trigger off Oak. Alright, I guess. IP, Promethean. I can definitely beat this board. For sure. I have no more Armored Exit card. IP Mask Arena. This guy does, does, doesn't know what he's doing. And Flamberg from the deck? Okay. Okay. Four. Okay. Probably just beat them with this. So, Promethean Princess brings back thing. Like this is this is terrible because he like what is he gonna do now, right? Like like what is he gonna do? Like brings back okay, put IP. You can't you can't summon the IP. You know what I'm saying? Like I guess you make ammo will here. I guess. I could be so Craig in here. I'm on this guy. Can we destroy a battle now? Can we destroy a battle? He's got a right hand. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I thought. Oh. Oh, Craig is insane. All right, bet. No, he can't even put IP in his phone trap zone. Amble will? All right, but it targets a fire monster. This is a water monster now. Yeah, guys, he's uh, he's not winning this duel for sure. I'm just gonna utopic feature him to be honest. He can't use Promethean to pop this at all. Okay, we can't draw. Yep. Let's go this effect. Normal summon Buzzsaw Shark. Oh, he used Divine Temple. Yep. Target itself. We can summon. XC's Remora from the deck. Oh, it's Bahama Shark. Oops. <laughs> you can't Promethean Princess this. Lifeless Fish. Immortal Beetle! Yeah! Fish! 
Please. Get me XZ's or more, bro. Ooh, ready fusion. I can't stop anything else, but 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 think so. It's fine. Utopic feature. Utopic feature. Now I overlay for Drake Hill Future. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know the vibes. Synchro summon. Yes. Attack mode. Effect. Destroy Amber Whale. Amber Whale. Utopic feature. Negate. Negate. Yeah! Uh, yeah, he, he, he really thinks he can beat this. This is impossible. There's two negates right here. Beto. Kraken. 3k. This is pretty nice. God dang, god dang. All right, this is Stone the Gates. You know what I'm saying? Okay, you know what I'm saying? I have effect, take control of it. And have another pop. We good, we good. Yeah, original. Yeah, put back the ash. Whatever you want, you want, you want to do. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you normal summon. It's gonna get stopped. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna get stopped. Make me harder. Make me lose my breath. Make me water. Hey, are you like? All right, thank you. Thanks for. Let me just take that. Nope. Shark! Baby shark do 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 Baby shark do 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 Baby shark Yo, if I see a branded fusion Okay, alright, you know what? That's a good sign, you know? If they start off with bang them That means they break We just hold the call by For the red and red I think we were Gucci, bro Yeah, please don't Please break, please My hand is just so good, but my name is Shark, and Shark always prevails. Shark's the best character in uh, his exo. Yes. The belly on? I thought, wait, wait, what? Oh. Oh, okay, got it. All right. I guess. All right. Brandon Beaks, all right. Uh, okay. Why don't you just go just dump this dump store in here first and then send anything? This this sequencing is absolutely terrible. Brandon regain. Okay, so this gets a regain. True, smart, makes sense. Lila? Light swords? God damn It's the Drees. And then of course, this, this is gonna melt three. This is gonna asset the regain. I like that. I like that. I like this little concoction here. But is it, is it strong enough for shark? I don't think so. Wow, it's bestial deck. Bestial light swords. I like it. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> Okay, let me go Shatana. Sh let me go Shatana. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Summon it. It's fine. Yeah, summon it, please. Summon Shatana, please. If one of those special summons a ritual fusion singer or XC's monster, you can tribute one other light or dark monster. Oh. Maybe that was not a good a good play. This this might not be good. Yeah, let me go this. I like this. Uh, summon, of course, this. I like this. Oh, yeah, let's send this. And then we go Abyss Shark, right? Abyss Shark here. Okay. And then we add Remora to our hand. Insane, insane, it's insane. You can go Kragen. Kragen! Oh, I actually got the attacks wrong. Okay. Doesn't target two. It's gonna kill Rebellion. Oh, I, I I actually misplayed here. His Druids. Should've back should have brought back Magnumut to be honest. Oh, he dodged the viller. What a nice guy. Good 
Damn. Okay. You can't tribute that. He has to use random beast right now. Oh my god, it's all level four. Good. Oh, it's all level four. I'm an idiot. Oh yes. Oh thank god. Thank God, please, please. Oh my God, this guy's ass. Guys, we're pushing through so many negates right now. Yeah. Okay. We wanted this to happen. Torpedo. Okay, it's nice like he's left. Activate this. Touch two. No way! No! Did you ask for turn? No. You gotta be trolling me. Did you ask off regain? Yo, Shark, I believe in you, Shark. We believe in you. Yo, Shark. Oh, this was pointless. Why did I do that? Okay, it's okay. Still got this. And it's a hand, yeah. For this. Come on, come on. We still do something. Remora. Come on. Summon two. Okay. Guys, we're still cooking, by the way. <laughs> we're not done. We're not done cooking. Please. Please, we're not done cooking. Dinner is still served, okay? Okay. Dinner is still served. <laughs> try, 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 try our best, okay? Please. No! That battle face? Why is he in battle face? GG's. Oh my god, that was one hell of a ride, ladies and gents. This shark deck is actually pretty insane. Holy smoke, this shark deck is actually pretty insane. We're going second, okay? Let's break some boards. All right, this hand is... Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's okay, potentially some... Wait, what? All right. Really, that's it? Maybe I... Okay, I honestly, I just lose the nib, no cat. <laughs> I just lose the nip, guys. You just lose the nip. Rare fish. Big fish. All right. Can we summon an under five summons? Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I think we can summon an under five summons. Yeah. Yeah, two. Okay, two. No, we can't summon under five summons, no. Honestly, bro, whatever, man. Like, I'm just not going to be a pussy, you know? Like, you actually don't don't win games by being a pussy, you know? Oh, yeah. I think it's game. If this works out, yeah, I'll just take away Imperm. Yeah, Armor Fortress. Or... Five. Five. Let's see. He is nip. See? He is nip. I knew it. I'm, I'm, I just, I just, I knew it. Like, you don't win games by being a pussy, you know? Hey, what? Hey, what? What does it do? Oh, I didn't know that that. Okay. Hey. He is nib. How? He's 
just do it, man. Just ass. I could have played around it, bro. I'm just greedy. I knew it, man. It's a greedy guy. Oh my god. Yo. Guys, you might have game. It's a water now. Yo. Yo. God, damn. I, I didn't even normal summon yet. I searched Buzzshaw. Oh my god, this is game. Oh my god. Yo, I cooked. Guy overcooked. Can't use that effect. But we can summon Ramora. Holy. We overcooked there. Bye. Have a great time. Oh my god, this is game. Through Nib? Oh my god! Through Nib! Yeah! Ah! Oh. That's what I call the magic carp splash, ladies and gents. Man, guys, we overcooked with that one. That was crazy. That was actually crazy. The shark cards are actually insane, ladies and gents. You don't do not sleep on these cards. Right, we're going first. This hand is actually insane, bro. Okay, this is actually insane because we can just we can actually play around nib with this hand too because we open up with the best shark. But I think I'm gonna go full uh, full combo right here. All right, you go foolish. You send leaf fish away. Abyss Shark is actually insane. Definitely has the Biru, maybe. The Crystallized Man. And we use Crystal Shock. Okay. And we, we go in. Okay, here we go. Crystal Shock here. And then we go this for Dugaris. And then if worse comes to worse, we can still, you know, like make Torpedo. No, uh, we can make Former XE still. Come alive and then go Abyss Shark and then it's pretty much game, right? Only thing we lose is kind of like Ghost Ogre, I guess. No. You draw two cards, discard one. You draw Remora here, we're actually just insane. Impermeer, yeah, see, it's okay. We played on Impermeer, which is pretty nice. So now, like, we we can't go to the Drake, the Utop Utopic Drake of Future out. That's okay. Okay. Yeah. But we see, we still have Torpedo. We still have to, uh, Armor Fortress access, which is really good. Four. Yeah. Yeah. Attach one, we'll add four MRXEs here. And honestly, guys, we can just pass on this to play around Nib. I don't know, I feel like Nib is just so, like, ugh. Let me activate this. Let me see if there's any toggle here. More. Okay. Oh, no, 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 he has no Nib. Doesn't check for Nib. Crystal zero here. No Nib. So we'll go here. So then of course Lancer. Yeah. We go special summon this. It's okay, we just attach two. You know what I'm saying? We can later add it back. And we can just go this. We can add an Alexis card. Yeah, this is not the greatest. Add another form. We can go these two into Kragan. I'd rather do that on our opponent's turn. So we have like another interruption, right? So we go this. Yeah, we just didn't have another fish to discard, which is kind of unfortunate, but that's okay. Okay. This is still like two interruptions with Maxi, right? Which is really good. Just in case we don't play into talents here, we're just gonna Maxi on draw face. Branded. Okay. Foolish. Oh my god, I should have made Dweller. This deck is actually insane, guys. Well, Armor XE is actually broken. He used these two cards to literally make Kraken. And then Mercury is going to summon Albaz, and we just use uh, Soul Craig and a pop it. Right? It makes sense, right? Because it's all water. Yeah. Mercury bottom deck? Sure. And then Mercury is going to activate. And Albaz. 
That's fine. Yep. Ecclesia? Almost like the target. Uh, we can go with this into Albaz, right? I'll just pop the Albaz. I think this is better. Eesh. Every time it sucks something, you know what I'm saying? It, 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 it gets wrecked. Oh, Armor Lancer is insane. Yeah, I got him checkmate. Yeah, it's good. Hmm. See what I tell you? What I tell you guys? Pops the Water Monster. Check, check, check me. Oh, he overcooked. Little sneaky guy. But honestly, like, I, I told you, like, there's nothing I could do. You know what I'm saying? Like, he has my he has my You know? Like, I, I really cannot do anything. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he overcooked. He, he's nice, nice. How do you draw Alibur in a 50 card Brandon deck? I don't, I don't understand how, how that works. Yeah, yeah. Because he's under maxi, like he's he's not killing me, bro. Only if he drew an ash blossom off that would have been crazy. What? Near Jade, okay, yeah, he's he, he has nothing for the extra deck. So he lost all yeah, yeah, I'm killing him next turn. I'll be odd, he's gonna get Brandon in red, that's fine. Yeah, Vanish the Lancer, sure. All my guys still water, you know what I'm saying? Like Brandon in red right now? Okay. Maybe he's overcooking something. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's under max C. Should have held that for my turn. Oh, okay. Masquerade. He thinks Masquerade's gonna beat me. He, th he really thinks Masquerade's. He has an opening in the grave. There's just so much that I can do with his hand, you know? Retribution. Season Moro here. Torpedo is what's gonna get me game because Torpedo can attack twice. Okay. Sure, everything's water. So Baldrick never triggers. Sure. Alright. Please. Okay. Summon Bell Drake, that's fine. Just more just just Wait, why can't I summon it? Oh, it's not level four. Effect. Summon Buzzshaw from my hand. Shuffle it back, bro. Please. What? Alright, we're just fishing now. Wee! Guys, he's 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 just letting this go through for no reason. Retribution. Alright, okay, okay. You cooking, you cooking. Shuffle back to Mirror Jade. Okay. Okay. All right. He thinks we're finished. All right, we go Bahamut. You can't, you can't do anything. Bahamut effect. Attach the fishies. Summon torpedo. And we go this, right? We go, we go this guy. All right. Into the Black Ray Lancer. All right, and then we go um, activate Remora, summon Remora, and then we're searching Remora, which is insane. Yes, add Remora, which is ridiculous. And then I think we go these two into future. Yeah, we go future here, right? Yeah, future. Yeah. And then we go here into these guy, Utopic Future. Yeah! yeah! Guys, we, we, we are not even done. What we're doing right now is called uh, 
Street Vi... All right. <laughs> Yo, guys, this shark deck is actually insane. I don't know. <laughs> this shark deck is so good. Baby shark, do, 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 baby shark. Baby shark, do, 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 do. Daddy, do 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 do